Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the inner world, where last time we left the wind tunnel area, the wind chapel area, and we made our way to this new area, which, uh, yeah, unfortunately has um, disclosed to us a, a bunch of very, very dark secrets that um, I believe Conroy does not want us, or does not want the rest of the Esposians to know about. So it turns out that Conroy himself is in charge of the Basilians. The Basilians themselves are some kind of mechas that he has been controlling and he has been using to seemingly randomly turn people to stone in an attempt to make a power grab for the whole of Esposia, which uh, is not great at all. So we're just traipsing around this forbidden area here and we are trying to navigate past these guards. These guards who are walking along the square path that is, um, they seem to be following footsteps that are in the shape of exclamation marks. We know that because the last episode um, Robert made mention of an exclamation mark that he was trying to get, so what you want to bet we have to get that. And uh, yeah, now we've just had a word with this kind little um, slightly evil parakeet, and we are trying to find a way to get past these guys. So what can we do? That is the question. We have a coffee pot with black varnish, a note from Laura, a flag, Conroy puppet that seems to have been very useful throughout this whole thing, and a poster that we can use as a disguise. So, let's start off with this here, maybe. Is there a reason why... Um... Ten push-ups! <laughs> okay, no. Um, hang on, what's this alarm bell? Ooh, okay. Oh, hammer. Oops. Broken. Hopefully nothing catches fire now. I have to find Laura. We do. Can we give Laura's note to the parakeet? No, now is no time to fool around. Alright, what about... We probably shouldn't, but... If the guard sees me, he'll lock me up. And if he imprisons me, Laura will kill me. I, I like um, Robert's priorities there. Okay, so what can we do here? Let's, um... Uh, hang on, hang on. That hammer... That hammer... Can we hammer away at the exclamation mark? Hmm, the letters are pretty loose, but this little hammer won't be sufficient. Oh, well, what's going to be sufficient? Um, like I'm not the the round construction piece. Maybe if we could take that, because there's nothing else. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Let's try this on his knee. Dr. Roberts here. Well, let's test your reflexes. Oh, yeah. Here we go. Oh! Okay. <laughs> That's good. Uh, let's check if this guy wants some black varnish coffee. Do you want some coffee? No, thanks. Haven't you heard? Conroy outlawed coffee drinking during work hours. Monster! Yes. There was a riot, and 25 people were killed. Okay, I think he actually mentioned this in the last episode. Alright, so that is pretty good. Well, we seem to have lost the hammer now. But uh, we have gotten the exclamation mark. Um, okay. Okay, 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 okay. Let's... Can we use this flag with the guard? That could be fun. Won't help, though. No, okay, let's head back to the parakeet. I'm guessing we have to get past him somehow. Oh. Oh, hang on. Just had a thought. Hang on. Yes. Here we go. Black exclamation mark covered in now varnish. Have an exclamation mark that's covered in black varnish. Oh yeah, you know where this is going to go, right? Um No, now is no time to fool around. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Okay, I see, I see where this game is going. Okay. No, I won't get past the guard. He's not very clever, but he's also not blind. Um... The guard, he means the parakeet. Then... Can we use... Can we use this on this guard? Well, I could, but I won't. Um, hang on. Is this? 
Do you need a flag? No. It reminds me of my old boydy comrades resting in peace under their flags. <laughs> under oh, their flags. no. Pull yourself together. They woke up eventually, once the sheets were gone. Bleh, damn sleep reflex. But that's our nature. Killer and canary. Oh, okay. Okay, 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 okay. So, yeah, so I think we need this. Come on. Do you need a flag? No, rest Reminds him of his bird oh, comrades. Yes. Then what can we do? That killer. killer and canary. Uh, okay, yeah, cage. Let's try it on the cage. So, time to go to sleep. Hey, what's this? What's that sheet for? No, please! We can work this out! Oh, that's brilliant. Okay, so now, yes, as you were saying, it makes him go to sleep. That's great. So now, can we... No, I won't get past the guard. He's not very clever, but he's also not blind. Um, how are we gonna do this? That won't work. Um, can we hit the bell? I can't steer... take any more stuff here. How do we get him to move? We need him to move. Hmm. Apparently, the guard's task is to follow the footprints, and they go in a circle. Sounds like an inspiring job. Uh, yes, yeah, so we need the abyss. Well, I could, but I won't. No, it's better for everyone if I let him sleep. Okay, so... No, no, wait! Don't eat the seat! That's... That's wife! Uh, okay, so he he's gonna sleep for sure. But now how do we get past this guy? Um Conroy Puppet? That's just a random guess, isn't it? That is a random guess. Help me out here, Robert. Um Whew, that was close. They almost saw me. What what else have we got? There's nothing else we've got here. No, he shouldn't see me. Right, I'm I'm a bit stuck here. Um oh wait, can we play our nose? Will that make a difference? Oh, of course. Of course. Now we need him to move once more. Okay, and now okay, 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 okay. I gotcha. I made wonderful tracks there. Well, they're not that great. Okay, now... <laughs> this is gonna be so bad. I, I know exactly how this is gonna go. They're doing pretty well at um, staying on the footprints. Oh my god, we've just murdered three guards. What have I done? What have we done indeed, Robert? What have we done? Come on, let's get out of here. And think about what we've done. Stop! Uh... Is that you on the poster? Then I would have to arrest you. No, no. If, if I'm standing here, I can't be the guy on the poster, right? Hmm... My brain hurts. <laughs> These gods. Can we take the poster? Hey, it's forbidden to take the posters down. I just looked. I didn't touch anything. You look a little like the guy on the poster. That's, um, my evil twin brother? I see. Okay, so maybe we can fool this guard with our disguise. Hey, I'm a guard. Impossible. If you're a guard, then what am I? <laughs> um, the Conway puppet? That's just a random guess, isn't it? Uh, can we give him Laura's note? I have a message for you. Look back there. <gasps> Look over there. What's over there? 
I can't see anything. Over there? Maybe I can see it if I look a little longer. Yes, carry on looking over there. That's brilliant. Um, okay. And now, can we take this? Can't. It's practically bombproof. Okay, oh, I see. Maybe do we have to put this one on? Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, this is gonna be good. Oh. Oh. Mm. Wow. I never would have thought that of myself. Well, then, I'd better arrest myself. Yes, that's what I should do. Will you cover me in the meantime? Sure, I'd be glad to help. I love these guards. I just, ah, oh, they do everything so by the book. It's great. No, it's good the way it is. Okay, so that stays where it is. To the laboratory, to upstairs, what's upstairs? <laughs> oh! Fong? I'm in the throne hall again? We're oh, back here. No. This brings back memories. Over there is my bunk, and back there is my dream corner. I always sat there and dreamt about being someone who didn't need a dream corner. We're back here. But this here is... This new. is where we started in the game. Mm, looks like Asposia, only darker and without life. I have a bad feeling. Oh no, I don't want to stay here again. Okay, calm down. How can I get out of here? There was a clicking sound behind the painting. Clicking sound behind the painting? We'll look at that in just a second. I can't take that with me. It's far too depressing anyway. So is... Yeah, I see. So is this what Conray's doing? He's getting the uh, the Basilians to attack all of the, the city, but basically he's in charge of things. A model of Asposia. But it looks different. Dark. Sad. Orderly. Orderly. Medical cabinet? What's in here? Conroy's medicine cabinet. Um, and he mentioned something here. Let's take a look. When the throne was closing, something made a clicking sound around here. It must have something to do with that painting. What I need is a clue. What you need is a clue. Okay, let's maybe try touching it. I don't know where it. to start searching. The clicking noise sounded like it came from the painting. But it's huge. Maybe on Conroy? Um, there's the trash. That's where we went down. Oh, there's Fonk. I hate you. I hate you. Yeah, Fonk. Uh, Basilian model, can we take this? Hello? Uh, can we put the Basilian model with this model? I don't think that will work. No. Um is around here. Piece of art. Oh, I destroyed art. Oh dear. Hey, Conroy's powdered sugar is in there. Conroy's powdered sugar. Uh, let's get some. No, I won't just take it with bare hands. Sometimes Conroy would give it to me when I was little. He thought it was funny how hyper it made me. It took me forever to kick the habit. Oh my word. Conroy gave him powdered sugar. Can we use the... Oh, that actually worked. Well, here's some of your old home remedy, Conroy. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, so we've got Conroy's powdered sugar. Uh, we've got a chandelier. Fancy and posh. And too far away. Can... Oh, no, not this one here. Can we... Use the Basilian at this? I can't do anything with that. We can throw it, can't we? What about the puppet? I can't do anything with that. Uh, let's go to the balcony. It's too dangerous out there, and too high to jump down. Okay, come on, we're gonna figure this out, guys. We are going to figure this out. Um, the Basilian model somehow with this here? I can't do that. Or somehow with the painting? No, now is no time to fool around. Or, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Quills? Let's get some quills. Aha, okay. Maybe let's try the quill and the painting. What should I stick it in? 
Okay, we, we still need a bit more, it seems. Um, can we poke Funk with his own quills? That's just a random guess, isn't it? That is just a random guess. Um, let's try the bazillion. Oh, no, no, the sugar. Let's try with the sugar. He won't touch the bazillion. He doesn't seem to like it. But maybe he'll like the sugar. Oh, yeah. Oh, man, that puppet has been through a lot. <laughs> Should I have a bad conscience? No. No. No, we shouldn't. Um. Oh, look. Chandelier glass? No, it's busted, and I don't want it. Oh, we can take this diamond. Thank you. What do you want to bet we have to give that to Laura or something? Um, okay, let's see. Does this give us any more insight into the painting? That won't work. No, um, nothing there. What about the trash chute? Sure, then we could have to start all over again. Then we have to start. Um, the throne room? The throne? <coughs> oh! Oh no, did we break it? You can certainly tell it belongs to Conroy. Oh, sweet, okay. Okay, 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 maybe this will work now. Let's try this on the painting. Well, I could, but I won't. Oh, come on, man. Um, well, how do we get out of here? I won't sit on it again. The Basilian model? That could be fun. Won't help, though. Hang on, let's pick up... The... We'll let him rest. We'll let him rest. What are we missing here? We, we're missing something. Spring. I don't think that will work. Chandelier won't work. Um, it has has to be something with this quill. What should I stick it in? I uh, can't stick the spring in there. Can't, can't stick the bacillion. That won't work. Hang on, will any of these join together? I can't do that. Why should I do that? Why should I do that? I don't know, I'm just wondering. Um, will any of these work with the throne? No, now is no time to fool around. Or oh, the medicine cabinet. Let's try that. That won't work. God damn it. Give me something, Robert. I don't think that will work. Alright, uh, let's try the model. I feel like that model has to do something. I can't do that. Hmm. Oh my word, is that it? We could have just opened it. Still full. Conroy's anti dandruff fish oil and his knockout drops. Uh oh. <gasps> there are more and more of them. I need to hurry. Okay. Anti dandruff fish oil, will that work on the painting? No, now is no time to fool around. Or if not that, then the throne room. Why should I do that? I don't know. I'm grasping straws here. No, now is no time to fool around. Ah, uh, let's try this. I can't do that. Why should I do that? Ah, uh, what would this work on? That could be fun. Won't help though. God damn it, Robert! You got to give us a clue here. No, no. Maybe dip the Basilian model in the powder. In, in the sugar. A white Basilian. Funny. Okay. Oh, I see where he's going. And then we use this here to look for clues, like to dust for clues, basically. Oh my word, this game makes you think. There we go. Ha! Huh. Fingerprints around a suspicious looking notch. And now the quill here, maybe? 
there's a tiny notch in it. Oh, come on. There we go. I better leave the quill in there so the throne won't close. All right, and now we can get back to the hangar. Cool. I mean, that didn't take too long. Um, right. Let's check out the laboratory. Oh, it's Laura! And, the, and her old man! I found him! Is that your father? Yes, I think he can hear me. Don't you think so? Hmm, the glass looks pretty thick. And he doesn't seem to notice that much anymore. Um, I mean, don't worry. He knows I'm here! Oh, that's not good. Dad! Okay, come with me. We'll find a way to get him out of there. No, I'm staying here. I don't want to leave him alone. But you haven't seen him in years. A few more moments won't hurt. And you won't even notice, so... Flute Nose, stop trying to comfort me. Sorry, I better go. Have fun. Eh? And don't die. Okay. Or I'll kill you. Yeah. Understood. All right, so I'm gonna... Bye. Well, okay, so we need to figure out a way to get him out of there. Let's... Hello? Can we talk to him? Can you hear me? Dad, can you hear me? <sighs> okay, maybe don't do that. What do you want to bet? We have to either get rid of that fly, or get rid of that guy's fly swatter, or we stop that guy somehow. We have to stop these electric shocks. Yes. Before his brain's completely toasted. Um, okay, Laura, can we talk to you quickly? Laura, don't you want to come with me? No, he can feel that I'm here. I don't even think he would notice if the laboratory was on fire. Oh. Alright, um, let's look around. Blueprints? Blueprints for a bazillion. Conroy, that madman. All this time, he's been terrorizing the people with machines. Who would have thunk? It's been Conroy the whole time. Cables, can we do I something? I believe these cables lead out from his head, or into his head. He's connected to the whole hangar. Creepy. So is the old man kind of directly in control of um, the Basilians? All right, replacement fist, assembly line. An assembly line with bazillion parts. It's the assembly line of death. Can we... Can we put some knockout drops in there? That won't work. Or some fish oil? I don't think that will work. Okay, that won't work. Um, Come on, let's look around. There's something. There's something here. Mechanical arms? The mechanical arms seem to be connected to his head. He controls the hands with his thoughts. Amazing. That is pretty special. Um, let's check out this hole. That most likely used to be the lift button. It broke off. Can we push it? Can we do something with it? That won't work. Or the lift here? A lift. I think it's meant for food, but I'm not sure. What can we put? Um, what else? Is there anything else? Let's, let's uh, rem, reminepo, uh, mechanical arms, assembly line. No, it's it's something to do here. Let's uh, let's see if we can open the door. There used to be a button there. Now there's only a hole which cannot be pressed. Can we use the spring? I don't think that will work. Um, what about the lift? It's empty, oh, okay. but I don't think I will fit in there. Um, fish oil on it? Oh, actually, wait, what's this grate? There we go, there he is. The button. A red glowing button. That can't be good. 
the weird guy. Maybe it's just the angle, but this guy looks weirdly askew. Uh, there's the assembly lines. The bazillion parts that Remineppo built are being transported there. It's quite calming after you've stared at it for a while. Okay, we're not going to stare at it for too long, though. The lift button. I guess he can use this button to call the lift. And the lift itself. Ah, that's where the lift goes. Uh, okay, 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 okay. Can we... Will that work? Fish oil in there? Don't know why we did that, but... Okay. Now what? Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, I don't believe it. <laughs> I know where this is going. This is very Acme. This is very Roadrunner. Looney Tunes. Fits like a glove. Oh, yeah. I think we know where this is going. So, in here... And let's try that again. And then what was it? Fish oil on the button? And then Kaplow knocks him out, stops him hitting the red button. Oh, wait, 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 almost, almost, I think, um, what was it, knockout drops, isn't it, yeah, because it gets to his nose, he smells it, he gets knocked out, yes, that has to be it, that has to be it, come on, the perfect weapon, let's go, I think that's a good plan, okay, Robert likes it, means we ought to like it as well, come on, this is going to work. Believe. Like, this, this has to work, because i got nothing else. Okay. Fly goes there. He hits button. Left door opens. And out cold. <sighs> Wunderbar. Hello, we turned off the electric shocks. Dr. Reminepo, you can move freely now. Dad, can you hear me? <sighs> Aw, he's getting a hug. Ooh. Hmm. Okay, we're supposed to get a diamond. Oh, we've got a oh, diamond. no! Where are we gonna find a diamond? Oh ho ho, don't you worry. We have got a diamond. Hey, Doctor, I have a diamond. Wow, flute nose! Thank you! Laura, it's not for you, but if you want, <laughs> I can get one for you too. Maybe attached to a ring. Flute oh. nose? What the hell are you talking about? Nothing. Nothing. Honestly, Laura should appreciate this here. The stuff we've done for her since she's met us. Like, without doubt, we are a top G. Like, we have made her world infinitely better. We've gotten her here to her father, who's about to get out freedom. And honestly, she was giving us, like, crap to at the beginning. My little tumble mouse. Tumble, tumble mouse. mouse. I've been looking everywhere for you. I'm so glad that you're alive, Daddy. My little tumble mouse. I knew you could do it. When did you grow up so fast? Don't matter. You'll always be my sweet little girl. Hmm. Uh, who's that young man over there? Dad, this is Robert. He helped me. Ah. Oh. Mm -hmm. I see. Mm-hmm. 
What are your intentions with my daughter? What? <laughs> uh, none. We just met. Dad, leave Flute Nose alone. He's really nice. They're always nice in the beginning. I've always dreaded the day when my little girl would meet and... Wait. Flute Nose? You survived. I, um, don't know what you mean. You must listen to me carefully. Ever since the beginning of time, a secret dynasty reigned over Asposia. All dynasty members had instruments as noses. They brought the wind to Asposia. They could control the wind by playing music with their noses? I see. Not control it. They created it. But the wind monks... They were initiated by the head of the flute noses. They were supposed to execute the dynasty's will. One monk for every fountain. The last three before the attack were Malleus, Pandur, and Conroy. We know those three, don't we? Conroy had his own ideas concerning reigning. Oh, man. I can imagine what happened. Please tell me, why not? Because I won't allow you to implement the death penalty again. But... End of discussion. We can't let him go on like this. He's dangerous. I know. Soon he will be able to play with us. Oh, darling. He still tries to eat his own hand. Give him a little more time. At that moment, Conroy came into my workshop. I refused to help him, but he threatened to harm you, Laura. I was supposed to build something for him, and... Abbot Conroy, what brings you here? I won't change my mind. I have decided to give you another chance. You now have the chance to acknowledge my free reign. And why should I do that? I have the Wind Gods on my side. There are no wind gods. There's only us. Really? Save him! Oh, I tried to do something. So basically, Conroy, yeah, he started it all. She didn't make it. Then Conroy took you. Why didn't he just turn me into stone as well? Without you, there would be no wind at all. Whenever I had to play for him... His wind fountain provided wind. Not much. It needs a whole orchestra to operate properly. But thanks to you, we haven't suffocated yet. Flute nose? I see. I'm sorry, boy. But you carry the responsibility now. Conroy has been forcing me to build an army of bazillions for 13 years now. If we don't stop him, then I don't know what's going to happen. What's his plan? The wind is becoming more scarce. He wants to turn all Asposians into stone who could steal his air. Sounds like him. Did you find the marbles that I hid? Yeah, sure. It was easy. But what are we supposed to do with marbles? We don't have time to play. We need to save the world. No, these are depetrifying marbles. We have to install them in a bazillion. Only if we can revive the orchestra do we have a hope of stopping Conroy. Okay, wait, so there's a chance and to depetrify everyone. Birthday, he allowed me to bake my own cake. I thought it was the most generous thing a father could do for his child. And then his stupid hedgehog ate it. Yes, listen, I completely understand that you're upset. Upset? I'm not just upset. How would you feel if you'd been lied to and betrayed your whole life? He took my family from me. He treated me like dirt. I am... Angry? Oh, am I angry? So, I installed the marbles. You should unpetrify everything now. Ocarino, are you ready? Who's Ocarino? Flute nose? Sweet Pea, show a little more respect. He's the legitimate leader of Asposia. Ocarino Augustus III. Say Flute what? Nose? Ocarino Augustus III? That sounds way better than Robert. I still think Robert is a nicer name. Uh oh. <laughs> oh, my boy, Ooh. why did you have to go snooping around? Now I have to kill you all. Oh. Uh -huh. oh.
Oh no. Oh no, Laura. You stay there. Not again. Enough. Free the Basilians. I've been nice for much too long. Like, so what, does he want to turn everyone in exposure into, like, statues? Oh no! The lady and her baby got turned to stone. Oh no, not little dirts. Alright, we, we are saving exposure, guys, come on. I can't have dirts being turned to stone. Wow, interesting. I survived without a scratch. Oh no. Finally, I have a de-petrifying bazillion, but it's broken. I probably shouldn't have crash-landed it. Okay. Guys, we're gonna take a quick break here. When we get back, I believe our resolve is firm. We know exactly what we need to do. Well, I believe so, anyway. We need to get this de-stonifying uh, bazillion working again and start unstoning all of the people in the orchestra so that we can save the goddamn world, especially debts. And Laura, of course, because we like her. And our old man, because he, he told us the truth. So we got work to do, which is what we're going to be doing next time. That's all for now. Thank you very much for watching, and I will see you next time.